Why is there a lump here? Ignore it! Everyone gets bumps! Just implant already! That dumb lump ate all my nutrients! I'm starving! Hey, watch your mouth! I claimed this spot first! You look like trouble! Get out of here! Alright, enough! Stop fighting! If you tear me apart, you'll both be done for! A few moments later... That was close! Finally full term! These two were so hard to handle! Things look tricky! You better prepare for a C-section! But I want a natural birth! I don't want a scar! See that big tumor blocking your cervix? Be glad if the baby comes out safe! Forget being picky! This was really dangerous! Luckily, you had regular prenatal checkups and prepared well! The baby's growing! We need to eat more for enough nutrition! All right! But overeating builds fat, and blood lipids rise too! Who cares, as long as we're getting nutrients! Why can't I suck anything in? Careful, you're crushing me here! Too much fat is squeezing me so tight I can't move! Oh no, the blood pressure is spiking again! What's happening now? Hold on, you can't collapse right now! Doctor, how's my wife doing? She's gained too much weight during pregnancy. Her blood pressure is high, the placenta has detached, and there's heavy bleeding. We'll do everything we can to save both mother and baby. After giving birth, my whole body has no strength left. Hey, you're pressing on me. It's so uncomfortable. Can I lean on you for a bit? Why so uptight? We each have our own space. Lean on me, and now I can't hold my pee. You complain too much. Look at the rectum. No complaints at all. Who says no complaints? I am constipated here holding it is killing me. Whatever you say. I'm so exhausted I can't even move. Hey, who are you? Why are you barging in here? Look, you're squeezing the organs around you out of shape. I'm a uterine pessary here to lift you back to your place. Doctor, can such a tiny ring really support the uterus? So do you want surgery instead? Of course not. Then use the pessary. It's safe, convenient, just disinfect it daily. Yeah, finally drinking time. Oh no, he's drinking again. Guess we're pulling another all-nighter. Relax, bro. Hey, big guy upstairs, move your butt. You're crushing my head. Wait, everything's spinning. Uh-oh, that booze is toxic. We gotta flush it out. Your turn, kidney. Clean it up. I can't take it anymore. I just need to sleep. Oh no, we're running out of water. Easy, bro. Borrow a little water from the brain. Hey, that's actually a great idea. Ugh, my head's pounding. Doctor, why does it hurt so much? You got a hangover. When you drink too much, your liver overworks and your body loses water. That's why your head hurts. Another cycle. Time to get ready for a baby. Wait, what's this bump inside me? Hello, I'm a polyp and I'm staying here. You're taking up space. Babies need room. Too bad, I'll just keep growing. No wonder I feel heavy and uncomfortable. An implantation can't happen properly. Doctor, why can't I get pregnant? It may be endometrial polyps, small growths inside the uterus. They're usually benign, but they can cause bleeding or infertility. Removing them helps the uterus stay healthy for pregnancy. Little one, hurry and meet your lover. Sorry I'm late, Miss Ag. Have you been waiting long? I just got here too. We need to reach the uterus and settle in quickly. Why is it getting tighter and tighter? It's blocked. Maybe I should turn back and find another way into the uterus. Yes, this path works. Better get to the uterus fast. This spot looks fine too. I can't go any farther anyway. Doctor, why is my stomach hurting so much? Is the baby okay? The fetus is in the abdominal cavity. I suspect this is an ectopic pregnancy. Little one, go on. May you find your prince charming. Wait, why am I even here? Hey, hi there. Are you waiting for someone? Yeah, I'm waiting for someone. <laughs> nice weather today, huh? Yeah, it's really nice. <laughs> So, why did you come here? Honestly, I'm not sure. Wow, same here. I don't know either. Oh no, my time is up. What? That was sudden. I need to get out of here. Why can't I ever get pregnant? In cases like this, the egg and sperm may not be compatible. Oh wow, my little baby has arrived. Time to find a cozy spot to implant. Got it. Here I go implanting now. That embryo's been implanted for a while. How can another one still succeed? What? I'm just a few days late. Can I implant too? Of course you can. You're all my precious little ones. There's still space. Go ahead. But this later one looks darker. Doesn't matter. My mission is done. Doctor, why do these two babies look nothing alike? That's a case of superfetation. They implanted at different times, so it's normal. But shouldn't this one looking like you be a bit unusual? <laughs> Ouch, I just ate, and now my stomach's burning. Why are you wide open? If there's no food, you should stay shut. Lately, I've been so weak. Closing up feels hard. Ouch, 
The acid's splashing all over me. Close up fast. Give me a break. I barely have the strength to shut. And now I'm injured too. Are you done resting? Here it comes again. Ouch. It hurt. Close up now. What's taking so long? Yelling won't help. I need strength to tighten up. Ouch. Doctor, every time I eat, I feel a burning fire inside. What's wrong? That's acid reflux. Keep a regular diet. Don't overeat. And avoid lying down right after meals. Hey man, what are you doing? My body suddenly feels weak. I can't stay closed anymore. Closed or not, it's the same. You're useless here anyway. Useless? Don't underestimate me. You'll regret it soon. <coughs> ah, that burns. What's happening? Acid is coming back up. Close it quick. The acid is splashing all over me. Didn't you say I was useless? Now you see how important I am. Okay, okay, I get it. Shut it fast. It hurts so much. Why rush? I haven't recovered yet. Being impatient won't help. Later. Help me. Doctor, after I eat, I always get acid reflux and burning in my stomach. This is acid reflux from a weak stomach valve. Keep a regular diet and cut down on spicy foods. Ouch, why am I feeling so dizzy? What's happening? Only this little blood flowing back. Trouble down there already? Quit yelling. I'm already crushed here. I'm glad you even got that much. Still making excuses? Hurry and push that ancestor down. <laughs> Such nerve. Let's see who dares to push me. Ow, ow, ow. Doctor, my head feels so dizzy. That's because in late pregnancy, the uterus gets huge and presses on your vessels. Looks like labor is starting. Wow, lucky me. I'm the only one who found Miss Egg. I'm still alive, still hanging on. I have to survive. Stop right there. Who are you? I'm an embryo. Show me your two chromosomes for inspection. Two, but I only have one. Not enough. You need two to get in. Hold on. Let me copy it real quick. There, now I've got two. All right, you may enter. Nice. This is great. Time to start growing. Doctor, how's my baby? Hmm, doesn't look quite normal. Oh no, another break? Forget the chatter, let's fix it. It was just one fracture. Why so many screws? Finally done. But with all these holes, my leg looks like a honeycomb. Your wife just had her leg fixed now, it's your turn. You two are truly a match made in the air. So soft and cozy, I'll just wait here. Huh? Why isn't it here yet? A few moments later. It's been forever and still no sign. I'm here, I'm here. Eggy sis, how'd you turn into Granny Egg? That's on you. You crawl slower than a snail. So, which way do we go now? That way, hurry and implant. Uh, I'm exhausted. Come on, you've barely taken two steps. I can't go any further. What is this thing anyway? Just flush it out already. Oh no, here comes the period. Looks like it didn't work this time. 